Use me as an example. A bad example. On this episode of The Bottled Novice, I'll be cleaning a glass footed filter. The filter is a little bit clogged and absolutely filthy looking, so I'm going to make some piranha solution. Piranha solution is two parts sulfuric acid and one part concentrated hydrogen peroxide. This stuff is incredibly violent. It will oxidize and destroy most things that it comes in contact with. And I'm the dummy that's not wearing gloves. If you'd like for me to have some gloves, you can click on the Patreon link in the video description. Any donations also go towards the creation of more videos and supplies to make them. What's happening here is the piranha solution is attacking the carbon which is clogging the frit. It's oxidizing it into carbon dioxide. The same thing would happen to a diamond if I threw it into the piranha solution. That diamond, which is mostly carbon, would be converted into carbon dioxide. I'd like to take this opportunity to say that you can also help this channel by liking and subscribing. And also leave a comment below. Let me know what you like about this video. Or you can let me know what kind of videos you like to watch. I'd really like to hear what suggestions you have on what kind of videos you'd like to see me make in the future. It looks like I may have overfilled it. But eventually it settles down. And the big bubbles are causing a lot of splash. So I have to cover that up. And again, without gloves. Golly. I really should wear gloves. The piranha solution keeps getting lower and lower, but just because it's run through the filter itself does not mean that it's not good anymore. So once it has emptied out, I remove the funnel and pour the solution back in. The solution still does its thing for a little while, but eventually it runs out of steam and it really doesn't do a whole lot.
When it seems like it's finally gotten to a point where it's not doing much at all, I pour it all out into a beaker and I put it on my hot plate and with some nice fast stirring, I, I boil off all the water. And then I start the process over again with some more hydrogen peroxide. With the way it bubbles, it kind of looks like a carbonated beverage, but I'd feel kind of sorry for anybody who gets a hold of it and drinks it. That would not end well for anyone. That sound was something falling on my tin roof. And this is where I'm going to stop. It's significantly better than it was. And the bottom of it turned out brilliant white. You can't see here. I'll post a picture of it. Here's a view from the top. It's not perfect, but it works a lot better and it looks a lot better. And here's the bottom view. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed. Please like, subscribe, and don't forget to hit that Patreon button in the description.